Marvel Studios' first series has arrived on Disney+. Yes! WandaVision is an absolute showstopper. The most unique storytelling yet. Are you here to help us? <laughs> it's taking the Marvel Cinematic Universe places it has never gone before. Last moment exaggeration. And there's no going back. It's full of surprises. Marvel Studios' WandaVision. Watch the first two episodes now and new episodes every Friday, exclusively on Disney+. Plus. How's it going, guys? It's Dylan from Anything Super. And if you're new, be sure to subscribe with notifications so you stay up to date with all the latest MCU news. The third episode of WandaVision just dropped and there is so much to unpack. Spoiler warning if you haven't seen episode 3 yet. In it, we saw Wanda reset the reality, gave birth to her twins as predicted, and did indeed end with throwing Monica out of their Truman Show bubble. There are so many more important details to go over, so make sure you stay tuned for our Sunday full breakdown video. Anyway, the ending was really interesting and warrants a bit of explaining. These were basically the last few minutes. Outside the house, Vision was talking with his neighbors, Herb and Agnes. Inside, Wanda was confronting Monica Rambeau about her slip-up. The ending is all about the reality crumbling around them. The neighbors are showing us they might know more than they're letting on. For instance, Agnes told Herb to stop talking before he told Vision that they were all trapped, suggesting she might know more than others but is still not necessarily a villain like some have suspected. The reality had a glitch when Herb broke through the wall there, and now Vision is beginning to question what's happening. Monica began to break the illusion for Wanda inside the house. She slipped up and revealed her knowledge of Ultron, then messed up again by forgetting what her name is supposed to be. And the last straw is the sword necklace that she's wearing. It's likely that Monica was sent in by sword as an agent, but she got trapped in the sitcom world as well. She has no home, no backstory, and is a danger to the believability of everything. So Wanda literally throws her out. Since she is likely the only person yet to exit the pocket dimension, Sword instantly swarms her with helicopters and workers. We predict it will take some time for Monica to adjust to the real world and remember what had happened before. A few things to remember for the next episode. Wanda tells Vision that Monica went home, although he now knows she has no home, meaning Vision will be exponentially more skeptical going forward. This could cause much more rewinding. Another thing to note is that the neighbors are sort of aware. They feel trapped, just like the doctor says that there's no escape, but they aren't really there 100%. Also, this was the first time Wanda name-dropped her brother since he died in the second Avengers film, meaning it could be foreshadowing for a Quicksilver return of some kind. Then, there's the fact that she seemed content with chucking somebody out of Westview, maybe hinting at a villainous aspect to all of this. Lastly, Wanda and Vision named their twins Tommy and Billy, nearly guaranteeing their upcoming Wiccan and Speed transformations. Be ready for our full breakdown of every hidden detail on Sunday. There are even more crazy easter eggs to go over. What do you think this all means? Are you excited to see episode 4? That's all I have for you guys today. If you're new, remember to slam the subscribe button because whenever new information comes out, we'll be reporting it. Also, feel free to follow me on Twitter, at SuperAnything, for all the latest updates right when the news breaks. See you all very soon. This has been Dylan with Anything Super.